We're out here having a nice little fire. I figured, let me go film the passion fruit and show you how much survived the leaves and the fruits. We had some immaturely fall off. All right. Frost cloth and the Christmas lights did the job. The ones that wasn't covered, the vines here, <clears throat> really got hit. So this fruit's about ready. Come in here. See, it did keep a lot of the leaves on. Here's some more fruit. And a lot of the small ones are falling off, and you see some of the leaves are going on the ground. <clears throat> so when you get to the lights. These leaves barely got hit. Look in here. There you go. Trunk really covered. It's gonna be like 34 tonight. But look how green these stayed. So I'll have a better and early crop this year. In spring, they'll be already producing. This year it won't be set back. Just have some fruits here. There was more on the other side. At the trip. Oh, here's a big one right here. Now the ones that fell early, they didn't never produce any pulp. You can see I just used some regular PVC pipe. I used some uh, rebar in the ground to hold the pipe up. Got some frost cloth with the Christmas lights and it made a difference. I'm working on a, another little project. You'll, you'll hear more about it when I get finished. Catch you later. Hope you enjoyed. Let's take a look at these fruits again. About to go back to the fire because it's getting chilly. Hopefully these will stay on enough, long enough to uh, mature all the way. Let's look over here before. So hey baby. She's got a little heat blanket. Over there. Yeah, I love these passion fruits. We love them. This is how much we love when we try to protect them. Trying to find the little, here they are. Little section. Yeah, there's some more out there. We'll catch you later.